production of zinc coffins increased dramatically in Russia, they are sent to Ukraine for soldiers. An increase in the production of zinc coffins for Russian soldiers killed in Ukraine has suddenly become a cause for pride in Russia, Ukrainian journalist Yuri Butasov wrote on Telegram. He shared a screenshot of the Tambov Metal Service Plant Management's post on the Russian online social media and social networking service VKontakt. Friends, we have great news, the post read. Metal Service is expanding its product range and is now proud to present zinc coffins. Zinc coffins are not just a product, they are a symbol of care and respect for those who served and sacrificed their lives for our country. Earlier, a new dress by Spanish designer Balenciaga was causing a stir on social media thanks to its uncanny resemblance to a sleek black plastic bag used to transport dead Russian soldiers. Balenciaga shared a photo of this unique outfit on their Instagram on December the 16th with a price tag of around $6,500. The BBC, Russian service and news outlet Media Zona have confirmed the identity of around 45,000 Russian soldiers who died in Ukraine since the invasion began in February 2022. The issue of military casualties is extremely sensitive in both countries. Russia has banned criticism of the conflict and no official figures have been released since 2022. The BBC, together with Media Zona and a team of volunteers, managed to establish the names of 45,123 Russian militaries who died in the war in Ukraine since February 2022, the report said. It only included the names of soldiers publicly identified in open source data, mainly obituaries, and warned the real toll may be twice as high. Two thirds of the dead we have identified had no links to the army prior to the invasion. Volunteers, mobilized, prisoners and private company recruits, the BBC's Russian language service said. 